which came out of the deli before when there was like, uh, let me get a Sprite, Snickers, and uh, some popcorn. The guy goes, one, two, three, give me five dollars. <laughs> I was like, give you five dollars or is it five dollars? And then he's like, you know, you look like uh, Michael Douglas. <laughs> Say thank you. Who's uh, Michael Douglas at speed dating? You want to get fucked? <laughs> Trump is Trump is unhinged, huh? God, he's unhinged. It's unbelievable. But I like his choice, his selection of words. Like he always says, disaster. Right? When you have to ask the candidates, like, what do you think about this candidate? Qualified? He's like, no, he's a disaster. <laughs> like, oh, is that, like disasters should be used for like hurricanes, right? School shootings. You know, a wild uh, weekend at the Jersey Shore. You know what I mean? Like, look, Hillary had too much to drink, okay? She woke up, she had vomit all over her face. <laughs> and then she took the sink, ripped it out, and threw it at the cops, okay? She's a disaster. <laughs> Bernie Sanders, though, is... We're gonna miss Bernie, though, right? It's unbelievable. I love Bernie. He, uh... He's great. He looked like a New York City school teacher, though. Like, ten years past his 30-year pension mark. <laughs> You know what I mean? He had like the egg stain on his shirt, right? The one thing out like this, you know? Every time you go in his classrooms, everyone's out of control. He's in the bottom of a fight in the middle of the classroom. He gets up, like, I'm telling you, I control this class. I control it. And then Bernie actually don't control the class. And you should retire. I'm gonna tell you right now, he's a disaster, a real disaster. And I have a lot of teachers that are friends. <laughs> Obama though, great eight years. Wow, so much consistency. When he first got elected though, his first term though, I felt he was like overwhelmed. He had a little bit of stage fright. He wasn't so like he went from like thank you, New Hampshire, all right, live free or die, prefer living, all right. Let's get a beer. But his first term, he was like nervous. I don't know, he had stage fright. I don't know what was going on with him. You know, in the press conference, be like. Whether it's uh, ISIS, uh, ISIL, uh, like I always felt like it was like the dad you walk in on when you catch him smoking pot. <laughs> like dad, look at her. Look at her. I'm just in there uh, uh, rearranging Michelle's CD collection. <laughs> All right, and. Uh, I'm letting you go back and go play with your sister. Come on. Get out of this thing. His second term, he doesn't care, right? Writing executive orders constantly, right? Unbelievable. He's like, Carvel? Uh, kids are not having Carvel in this country. Let's sign that executive order. Okay. Candy apples? That's it. I don't know. He's brazen at the press conferences, right? It's like ISIL, uh, ISIS, uh, your mama's pie hole. <laughs> you think I care? Because I don't. He's getting home late, drunk at night, right? Michelle! Michelle! Where are those sweet potato fries, man? Come on! Where's my lighter? Uh, where's my lighter, Michelle? Where's my pants? He's a real disaster. Eight years of getting drunk, okay? I uh, was watching the Rocky Marathon last week. Alive. Unbelievable. I love the one scene in Rocky 1 when he goes in the gym. He's like, yo, Vic, looks like I'm going to be a spar partner for Apollo Creed. And then Mickey's like, didn't hear it the first time, you dumb dago! <laughs> like, you guys don't see trainers like that anymore, do you? You wouldn't go to Planet Fitness. <laughs> right? See a guy with a hearing aid. A triple bypass guard. I know belly button. You're on the elliptical. <laughs> Man, I'm exhausted. Mick, is, uh, you think it's a better idea than P90S? Don't look at me, you fairy! <laughs> better I'm working out in a purple gem! <laughs> and Sloan's amazing because he was Rocky in every movie, right? Every movie, even Rambo, right? He's like in the prisoner of war camp, he's like, whoa, They're like, I got, we got Rocky, the day, the day! Hey, wait a minute! I'm Rambo in this movie. I'm not Rocky no more. <laughs> Are you Rocky now? <laughs> we gotta get these boots right now! Hey, Mick, what is going on here? How'd you get into this movie? What's happening? Even in Cobra, remember?
remember that? He's like, you're the disease, I'm the cure. Put that guy away! Hey, wait a minute, where did you come from? What the hell is going on around here? Stallone even did a porno. I don't know if you knew this before that, right? I don't know how that went. He's like, oh, man, this feels really good. Oh, yeah, I feel it's really good. Yeah, back my head. Hey, wait a minute. This is a soft porn. What's going on with this? Yeah. Put that cock in that vagina! Hey, wait a minute here. This is ridiculous. Every one of them. I think I watched Rocky too much on the weekends. My wife's gonna get out of me. Going back to politics. I gotta confess to you guys, I, I miss George W. Bush. I really do. I, I gotta confess. I know about 100% uh, of you didn't vote for him. <laughs> but um, I miss him. I miss him. He was, uh, he was definitely the most entertaining president we've ever had, right? It was like, those press conferences were like watching a national televised spelling bee, <laughs> right? Like, Mr. President, next word is war. Uh, uh, well, uh... Well, a war is definitely something that happens. <laughs> you know? And, uh... I'm not about spelling stuff. You know? Uh, I'm more about doing things. And, uh... And the Adderall would wear off mid-sentence. <laughs> like, look, our racks of war, and, uh... uh Laura has mean macaroni salad. <laughs> but, uh, I'm definitely feeling pretty good about stuff. <laughs> He was a real disaster. Unbelievable. Katrina was nothing. <laughs> I just got I got pulled over last week by the cops. Undercover police pulled me over. We were driving a yellow taxi. Cops got out of the car and goes, uh, license registration. It's like, do you realize that you were driving in the bike lane? And I turned to him and said, do you realize you're driving a yellow taxi? <laughs> This traumatized me. I feel like I can't even get ice cream at the Mr. Swaffy truck anymore. This guy's gonna ask me for ID, you know? We just got married. Woo! Thank you! Thank you. Yeah, I had to go to uh, something called pre Cana, which is the marriage preparation for Catholics. I sat there with my fiance. I said, uh, the priest says, listen, if you ejaculate outside the vagina, it's a sin. And I thought to myself, what kind of porn is this priest watching? <laughs> Some disturbing stuff. How does he know where I'm aiming my thing? I don't want him picturing that. I can't even face him in confession right now. I like, sit down, he's like, buzz me, Father, I have sin. He's like, so? Did you? I didn't, Father. <laughs> you thought I was, but I didn't. I'm a good Catholic. And stop thinking those dirty thoughts. Amazing, when you get engaged though, it's, it's interesting when you get engaged and you tell guys who are married, right, you're like, I just got engaged. They always like give you that look like, right, right. You know? Like you just bought a pair of jeans at like Lord and Taylor, and it's not too late to return them. <laughs> look, marriage is a disaster. I've had three wives, okay? It really is. Did you vote for Trump? Would you? No. Yeah. You probably will, but you know you're here. It's all right. You know you're out here somewhere, closet Trumpers. I know you're here. You know the guy in the back's like, yeah, I'm never voting for him. He gets in his car, he's like, yeah, I'm fucking voting for that guy. I don't want the ship to go right off the fucking rails. That's what I want to do. You know what? I uh, was watching a YouTube video of Sir Richard Branson. He's the owner of Virgin Airlines. And, um, it's amazing, I didn't know this, he's uh, dyslexic. It's amazing, so. In the interview, the uh, person goes, so Richard Branson, you are a billionaire, yet uh, you can't read. He goes, <laughs> <laughs> Ma'am. <laughs> Ma'am, I, 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 um, I, um, no, I don't like to read. <laughs> Like, what do you mean you don't like to read? That's like, what, that's like, boo! Uh, hello, this is Richard, your captain. Uh, I don't know if we're ascending or descending. Because <laughs> I actually don't know the meaning of this words. <laughs> Fly the plane straight to my <laughs> Let's get on the flight without yelling at people. I 
Thanks, Kevin McGee. Thanks, guys.